All right, guys, stick around because Nathan's going to share a dream. This is sort oh. of Ryan. This, Ryan's going to react to Nathan's okay. dream. Yeah. So yes. I don't know what he's going to tell me. This is a real thing. This is legit. Nathan had a dream, apparently, especially when you're sick, you kind of have feverish dreams, right? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. So this is like a dream that's very vivid, and you're going to tell me about it. Okay, here we go. So I don't remember dreams very well. And right at the at the beginning of this, I'm sure people are like, oh, you, you had a dream? Was it a sexy dream? No, actually, it, right, it probably right, right. could have been, but it 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 wasn't. It was it was a very real dream. And I want to say this at the mm-hmm. beginning. What actually what happened is not real. So people who are trying to like, I don't know, right. make more out of this than it is, <laughs> go ahead, do whatever you want. The dream. Um, you had a dream. It was a dream. It was <laughs> okay. a dream. I so I have a lot of dreams. I I even when I like it's not this kind of a thing. I have a lot of dreams where I'm solving some kind of a puzzle or we're trying to like fix something. And and it's often with a group of people where we're where we're going places. Okay. In this particular dream, there was kind of a, a number of young people, and Taylor Swift was there. <laughs> okay. Okay. And I I was sick. So I just like I am, I was like shaking because I was cold. And oh. we were going from like house to house, it felt like. But it was okay. the most it was the most real uh feeling that Taylor Swift was like a, a mothering kind of a personality. Oh. And it was like I was talking to her all the time. It felt so much like she was this close friend. Um and at some point in the the dream, like I'm shivering, she's like holding me to like war- keep, keep me uh warm me up. And sure. And then she joked like, yeah, now everyone's going to say that you slept with Taylor Swift. And I was like, oh, right, right. Right. And, and so that's kind of the thing that I woke up and I'm like, hey, I slept with Taylor Swift. Uh-huh. <laughs> but it wasn't like I slept with. It was more that I was like, like, right. I felt like I knew her mm-hmm. as a really good friend. And I felt kind of like, I don't know, it just made me it changed how I thought of who she is all of a sudden, where I went from kind of like, mm-hmm. oh, it's Taylor Swift, the, you know the huge superstar that does to like, Oh, it's Taylor Swift. Like my friend that I've known for years who like, took, who took care of me while I was sick. Um, and, and I, I just woke up with that feeling of like, like what a wonderful friend I have, even though it's not real. None of it's real. It never happened. Everybody, you can make whatever you want out of that, but, uh, no, I'm it's, not in love with nice. Taylor Swift. I, I, I didn't actually sleep with Taylor Swift. Okay. But I wow. did my dream. <laughs> that's nice that's a nice story uh, that's a nice dream maybe we should, well we're gonna we have a video record of it now so you don't have to write down so mm-hmm. my dream of taylor swift i put her really hard it was amazing um okay so um uh, i was trying to make it pg but whatever